Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So, I am leveling up, ranking up some champions. Uh, this video covers two level up events. I've been trying to keep it to just two instead of making one big giant marathon 30 minute video of me ranking up different champions. Now, uh, as you could see, this one didn't have an advancement, so I'm not making a big push. So my main goal here is just to get the milestones. All right. So I pulled that Namor a while back and he was still at rank two. So I decided to go ahead and take him to rank three, even though it did take mutant T4 class catalyst. And that's something that uh, I've been sort of thinking about because my main focus has been on pushing my six star roster and ranking six stars up takes those same catalysts. So by taking him up even to rank three, I'm using resources that I could be using to take up a six star. But I decided to go ahead and do that. And I do still rank up four stars, but I try to make them uh, only to rank four. Uh, that doesn't take any uh, catalyst, but I'm starting to run out. I'm starting to run out of uh, four stars to take uh, to rank four, but we're not there just yet, all right? So I just have to be careful. Uh, I took Terax here uh, to rank four, you know, just, just for those points. And I think... Um, I'm trying to think of, of uh, whether I did something else. Uh, now, by the time uh, you guys see this video, you'll already know that I took up another mutant champion, six star to rank three. Well, the reason I didn't have enough mutant ISO in that video is because I was doing this, okay? Uh, I, at the time I did this, I didn't have that champion and didn't know I was gonna be able to get that champion. Uh, this all happened, um, as you can see in the title, uh, this happened before Cyber Weekend. So I had no idea of the crazy good value uh, that was coming towards us, okay? I was just thinking of a uh, Awakening Gem, all right? So you can see here, I had waited till the last uh, event to see if I could double dip with an advancement, and I couldn't. All right, so we did that. Now this is another level up event, the second one, uh, four days later. And as you can see, we only have like 25 minutes because again, I waited to see what that final uh, event was gonna be. That's what I try to do to be as efficient as possible. Uh, if I can get more resources, uh, even though the advancement is, uh, the rewards are kind of dated, it's still free resources and they're still useful somehow. All right. Now, of course, by this time, uh, you guys have seen that I pulled Scarlet Witch as a five star. That was huge because right now I have all of the five stars. After I got that Namor, I had all of the five stars that are in the crystals, uh, as far as I know. And the only ones left were the exclusives and the trophy champions. Scarlet Witch was one of those. And she came to the featured five-star crystal. And I know a lot of people would ask me questions like, um, should I go for basics or featured? And my standard answer is always, if you have to ask, then the answer is basics. And that's because people who are going for um, featured know why they're going for featured. Okay, I went for basics all the time. But guess what? Now, all I need to do is featured if the featured has someone in it that I need. And in this last featured uh, pool, the only champion I needed in that entire pool was this lady right here, Scarlet Witch. OK, so I opened up nothing but features and fortunately I was able to get her with only a few uh, tries. It didn't take too long. So I'm very, very happy about that. And as you can see, uh, I took her up 
to rank three. I really like having all of my five stars to rank three for arena purposes, but I'm starting to uh, slow that down just a little bit mainly because I want to have the resources to level up my six stars. All right, you can see the final score um, for uh, that level up. All right, um, I'm trying to think. I, I, I thought this was only uh, a couple of level ups. I could be wrong. Um, I may have uh, uh, done another level up. Let me see. Or I might have done more uh, ranking and leveling up. It's been a while, you know, so I can't remember exactly uh, what all I did here. Let me see. Yeah, we still had Cersei. Um, I, did I decide to make... Okay, so I decided to make a push then. Uh, when I saw the score, 73, I said, you know what? I can make a push for like a hundred and something thousand. And, uh, you know, basically the only thing that I get out of uh, the one to 10% that I want are the tier four class catalyst crystals. That's the main uh, goal uh, for the one to 10%. And I had to think about this because I, I don't think I did this in another one because uh the more that i rank up in you know making these pushes i use up the champions like i told you that i'm running out of four star champions to take up to rank four so i want to be very very careful about that now uh i did have those rank up gems from uh the event that we had here recently all right uh and i hadn't purchased any they it just reset all right so um i usually buy all of them t4 basics i want them i want all of them uh i need them to rank up uh five stars and uh uh some of the six stars as well so definitely uh want to buy all of those the t1 alphas sometimes uh i'll buy them uh, it really depends on whether I need them to, you know, level up or rank up someone. All right, so back we are uh, to Cersei here. And as you can see, uh, you only need the T4 basics. You don't need the uh, Tier 4 class catalyst to take her up to rank 4. Now, uh, if I remember right, there was an event that we were still doing, uh, Side Quest where you had to bring in Cersei uh, for Gated Paths uh, and Icarus. And I think I took her up just so that if by some chance I needed to use her a little bit, um, it wouldn't be as bad as bringing in the three star. But I never got into that situation. Uh, this was more about pushing. All right, so you see here we got 20 minutes left and I'm at 119. I like to go to at least 130. You don't need to go that high, but if you've watched me, you know I like the overkill. Uh, I think 120, uh, some people were telling me, uh, was enough. You know, just about 120. Um, but I don't think, I, I think I've missed once at 130, and it was after a big major uh, event like July 4. Uh, or something like that, where people were ranking up and leveling up tons and tons of champions. Um, that was the only time uh, I missed when I went to like 130. Other than that, no, no missing. So you see here, I'm just looking around for somebody to uh, take up. You see, I'm looking for the resources that are needed to make sure that uh, it doesn't need the uh, T4 class catalyst, which means they're ranked three. Because all of my four stars, I believe, I usually uh, take them to rank three right away uh, if I can. All right, so uh, we're going to take her up. And I believe that was it. Um, after I took uh, Phoenix up, I think I had the points that I like uh, to stop at. 
Uh, hold on, we'll look at it in a minute here. Okay, yeah. So 138,000, and that was enough uh, to get me the one to 10%, all right? So that's gonna do it for this video. Hope you enjoyed it. Um, leave a like if you enjoyed it, leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about the video. And you all have a blessed day.